Now it's time for the Coach Penny Hardaway Show, presented by Cook's Pest Control. The show is supported by your local Toyota dealer. Visit buyatoyota.com. Toyota, let's go places. Subway, make it what you want. And AutoZone, from parts to helpful advice, AutoZone has everything you need to get in the zone. AutoZone. Happy New Year, everybody, and welcome in, and what a year it has been for you, Penny Hardaway. I, I <laughs> tell you what, just unreal. You've got two publications now that name you Sports Person of the Year, mm -hmm. but let's, let's sort of reflect on this year for you. It starts mm -hmm. with your third straight high school championship at East, and that had to make you feel very fulfilled. Yeah, absolutely. I mean, those kids I have been with since middle school and to finish my career off with the third straight State championship with those kids, uh, it's a beautiful feeling. Yeah, and then you decide, okay, I'm moving on. I'm going to take this U of M gig, and that was a lot of work to get that done. Yeah, uh, you know, it was uh, an amazing season for me. Season for me in high school, it wasn't so great for the Tigers. And, of course, we know what happened, and uh, for me to be able to get this job, it's, uh, it's a blessing. You know, I, I really wanted it. Uh, I felt like the timing was perfect on it, and, um, you know, we're here now. It, uh, <laughs> It was, a, it was an amazing feeling, though, to get the call and say that I was going to be, uh, be you know, named the head coach. And, and then you got to work quickly. And boy, duh, do you ever, because you come up with a top 30 class in basically three weeks. Yeah, I got with Tony Matlock and hired him first, you know, my, my former backcourt mate at the university. And he and I got together. And, you know, he's so, you know, he, he was my, my right hand. He took me through all the, the situations that we needed to go through right away with the compliance. And then we got out on the road right away and started recruiting. And like you said, got the top 30 class. Uh, got some really good talent, you know, getting into the game so late. And, and, and then, with a little bit of time, but a lot of work and diligence and plane trips and van trips and all kinds <laughs> of selfie trips, you end up with what could end up being a top five class in the country for the next year. Yeah, the one thing about college basketball, your work is never done. You're always recruiting every day, all day. And, uh, you know, we weren't going to settle for just, you know, having a top 30 class. We want the number one class in the country in recruiting every year. So uh, we, we kept recruiting. We kept, uh, like you said, put the van on the road, put the planes in the air, and kept recruiting kids and uh, ended up landing some really good kids. I don't, I don't think it could have turned out any better for, for you. Uh, I really don't. We'll talk more about that. And, of course, we will show you Memphis and Florida A&M, and I know you're going to love the way this thing comes out. A little bit of inside access so the players will tell us what they want for 2019. Then the AutoZone Road Ahead, one game at home to start the conference play, the other on the road at a brand new stadium in Houston, Texas. Lots to talk about today on The Penny Show.